This scene captures the essence of Lincoln's determination and thirst for knowledge, a story that continues to inspire. This specific 2009 Lincoln Senate, known as Formative Years Penny, has been graded MS67 red by PCGS. This grade denotes a near-perfect coin with full red luster, making it exceptionally desirable among collectors. The MS67 red grade signified its pristine condition while the rich historical significance of the design adds to its allure. Collectors highly covet this coin not only for its beauty and rarity but also for the story it tells about Lincoln's formative years. Its significance was reflected in its sale at the Great Collections auction on July 7, 2024, where it fetched an impressive $248.62. The 1984 D. Jefferson Nickel graded MS67 plus full steps by PCGS is a standard coin that has captivated collectors. This coin's allure lies in its full steps designation, signifying that the steps on Monticello facet are fully visible and sharply defined, a rare highly prized feature. The MS67 Plus grade highlights the coin's nearly flawless condition, boasting superior luster and exceptionally sharp details. Adding to its charm is a stunning toning, showcasing a unique and attractive color variations that enhance its visual appeal. Collectors treasure this coin for its combination of high grade, full step designation, and eye catching toning. Its exceptional qualities were recognized at the Great Collections Auction on July 7, 2024, where it sold for an impressive $4,563, including the buyer's fee. This gem is more than just a piece of currency. Again, it's a testament to its artistry and craftsmanship of American coinage. Here's famous double diaverse scent, worth a lot of money, even in brown condition, graded in mid state 64 red and brown by PCGS. See, the endorsement adds to the appeal of this near gem red and brown double dye scent. Luminous satin luster yields hues of gold, amber, steel blue, and chestnut brown. No spots disrupt the appearance, and there are only few tiny marks. The 1955 double dye of verse scent was widely searched for in circulation in the 1950s, while advanced collectors today appreciate the quality of high end mint state coins. Doubling is included in all obverse letterings, a clear cut. This rare penny was sold for $7,200 at Heritage Auctions. Believe it or not, this Washington quarter recently fetched over $3,700 at Great Collections Auction. This tone quarter dollar was graded as MS68 by PCGS. Achieving an MS68 grade signifies that the coin is in near perfect condition while only the slightest imperfections are visible under magnification. This level of preservation is extremely rare for coins from this era, especially considering the high circulation of quarters. The 1966 Washington Quarter features crisp details and strong strike and brilliant luster, making it a standout example. Its pristine condition contributes to its high value and desirability among numismatists. Another beautifully toned superb gem, 1942 P. Jefferson Nickel Type 2, graded as PR68 Plus by PCGS and later proven by CAC. By the late 1941, US Mint had already begun experimenting with alternative compositions for both cent and five cent pieces. Copper and nickel were both essential to wartime production, and their use in coins was secondary importance. The US preferred to resume coining silver half times similar to the last produced in 1873, but the vending industry could not retool to accept both this coin and existing nickels. A poor compromise was arrived at in which the standard size 5 cent piece was struck in alloy of a copper, silver, and manganese. Coins of this composition were distinguished with oversized mint mark placed above the dome of Monticello. In retrospect, it's quite remarkable that the mint even offered proofs of the new issue. These coins were not struck until the closing months of 1942, when the mint had it hands full, meeting accelerated production figures. Wartime nickels were sold separately of the proof sets, and collectors gobbled them for their novelty and perceived future rarity. The super gem was sold for $7,593.75 with buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction.
The American economy regained strength towards the end of 1938 and improved steadily over the next few years. Yet the Great Depression was not finally put to rest until the nation's entry into World War II in 1941. This progress is evident in dramatically increased production of quarter dollars at the Philadelphia Mint for 1939. Such a number of coin has resulted in large numbers of Mint State survivors spanning a range of dice states from hard, smooth surfaces to deeply furrowed. While the latter often displays dazzling luster, the discriminating collector should seek an early die state with sharp details. This attractively toned Washington quarter was graded as MS68 Plus by PCGS. It was sold for $7,717.50 on July 7, 2024, also at Great Collections Auction. As a modern rarity, for many of you, 1994D quarter dollar is nothing but a pocket change, but in uncirculated condition, this issue can sometimes fetch significant premiums. This quarter dollar was graded as MS67 Plus by PCGS. The 1994D Washington quarter graded MS67 Plus is a remarkable coin recognized for superior condition and eye appeal. The MS67 Plus grade indicates a coin has a beautiful luster, a well-defined details, and only minor imperfections that are barely noticeable under magnification. Struck at Denver Mint, this quarter dollar stands out for its nearly flawless preservation and strong strike, making it a highly desirable piece for collectors. Its pristine state and the plus designation signify that it is at the high end of MS67 grade, adding to its collectability and value. It was sold for $2,524.50 with buyer's fee at Great Collections Auction. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment with your thoughts. And don't forget to subscribe to CoinUts for more fascinating insights into the world of numismatics. Hit the bell icon to stay updated on all latest uploads. God's willing, see you in the next episode.